Making online payments for your Facebook ads, Instagram ads, Google ads, and even any type of online shopping has been an issue for you, then you probably need to watch this video till the end. Because in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you a fantastic virtual dollar card platform that is going to solve all your online payment issues. Welcome to my video. My name is BizLift and this is BizLift NG. We talk about how you can improve your sales and also grow your visibility on platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and other social media platforms and so in this video a lot of people have reached out to me saying that they have issues with making online payments whether they have a debt on their account that they're trying to clear or whether they are trying to just pay for their ads in dollars rather than pay for it in naira yes we know that there are other people that are outside nigeria that really want to pay for their ads in dollars and there are also people in nigeria that want to pay for their ads in naira whether it is facebook ads or whether it is google ads or whether it is even shopping on platforms like amazon or even other online shopping platforms where a dollar card is needed whatever it is that you're doing online that requires paying in dollars or using a dollar card is finally going to be a walk in the park for you after i've introduced you to this platform now the name of this platform is pst this platform is a virtual dollar card platform and it's going to help you to create a virtual dollar card in any currency whatsoever that you want to use that card in so if you want to use a dollar card or you want to use a card in euro it is going to help you create all these different cards that would work for these different things that i've mentioned earlier this platform is also very easy to set up so you don't need to do a lot of work in setting up this platform i'm just going to head over to my laptop and show you exactly how you can set this up you can do this on any device that you own but i'm going to be working you on how to get started using my laptop okay so we're going to go to the platform the name of the website is called app.pst.net so when you go to app.pst.net it looks like this and then all i'm going to do is i'm going to continue with google so easily i'll just continue with google and use one of my emails to sign up all right so once you continue with any of your email you can use your email to sign up so once you continue with your email it will bring you to this page and then all you have to do is that you need to verify your account now to verify your account is very simple and it's straightforward and you can easily do this within 10 minutes now all you have to do you can see it here from the dashboard you can see you have a usdt account here you have a bitcoin account here you have a us dollar account and you also have a euro account here right if you click on the plus sign what it means is that you can actually deposit using a usdt trc20 um, payment method if you have someone who sells bitcoin you can easily send them this address and you can use it to deposit into your pst account so that means once you send somebody this your wallet address they are able to send you money and then you will receive that money in usdt okay so that is for usdt there are other ways to also pay there are other ways there's bitcoin there's ethereum you can use other coins to actually get in money here as long as you have somebody who is going to be helping you to fund that account all right so i'm going to just close this now another thing you can do here is that you can actually also deposit with bitcoin so if you have someone who can sell you bitcoin and then you can receive bitcoin right here so this can actually be your that's also your bitcoin wallet you can just copy the wallet here and then somebody can send you bitcoin as well now let's go to us dollar now to deposit in us dollar all you have to do is that you have to convert your usdt the money that you have gotten from your usdt to us dollar so it's really simple that way or you can also convert money from your bitcoin account to your dollar account that way you are able to create your card okay so that is what you can do. so it's easy and it's very seamless you can always do it now the other one is the euro account the same way you can actually convert your money from usdt to euro and you can use that to create your virtual euro card now once you have created all this or once you have deposited money the next thing you want to do is go to my cards right so you go to my card this is where you're going to be able to create the card that you want to use okay so all you have to do is to issue a card but before we do that let me show you exactly how to get verified on ps t all right to get verified just click you see here where it says not verified you're just going to click that place where it says not verified then you're going to select all your details select your country okay i'm just going to type nigeria here straight type in your first name and then your your last name and then you can impute your date of birth okay 
so and then you click continue so what you have to do is to click submit so that submits your information and you can see here that we already have verified this account in case you want to increase your maximum deposit you might need to upgrade your account now look at it here we have submitted our citizenship and our full, full name and it is verified but we have a 500 dollar maximum deposit $500. So if you want to increase it to $2,000 maximum deposit, you have to upgrade. And what will be required for you to upgrade is actually the passport, your passport or your ID card number. So if you have that already, you can easily upgrade by just clicking upgrade and then you select the country again. Okay. Select the country again and then you continue and then they will ask you to submit this. So you'll be taken to the platform where you're going to submit all the necessary information and everything. It is pretty much very easy for you to submit and upgrade, okay? But if you don't have any reason to upgrade to the next level of deposit, then you can just leave it as that. This really, really works, okay? So once you have done this, the next thing you want to do is to issue a card, all right? So let me show you exactly how to issue a card. So to issue a card, all you have to do is click on issue, issue a card. And then you will see it here to tell you create a new card now there are different cards that PST has which is why I love them a whole lot now they have card for purchases say you want to use this card to buy things online whether it's Twitter whether it's Pinterest whether you want to um, use this card for purchases online you can actually get this card now they have cards for advertisement say you want to use this card for advertisement you want to do an advertisement you can actually use this card right this card works on platforms like google ads they also have a card for facebook ads you can also create a card for facebook ads they have cards also for google ads separately they also have cards for tiktok i've gotten a lot of people that have sent me questions about tiktok ads i want to run tiktok ads but i don't have cards to pay this platform is going to really help you to create that okay so all you have to do is just to pick the one that you want and then you can just click on um, i'm going to create the card for advertisements click on get card now when you get card there are different cards here you can see it here there's a visa card there's a mastercard they're actually in collaboration with mastercard so you can actually issue mastercards right on pst so you can see it here um you can see the mastercard they have visa card and then they have the recommendation of what these cards can be used for this card can be used for facebook pinterest google you can see all the platforms right here and then you can see they have private cards for people who want to create multiple cards but for those who are just using these cards for personal purposes or commercial purposes i would advise you just go with these cards that are not private but these cards have a monthly payment of ten dollar they have a monthly payment of ten dollar and also they have a top-up fee of six percent so if you're adding say five hundred dollar six percent of five hundred dollar you're going to be paying that as a top-up fee and then every month you are to pay ten dollars for just card maintenance and all those things this really is going to be a lot helpful to a lot of people so forget about the monthly payment or the top-up fee these things are really small compared to how this card will help you a whole lot all right and we all know that right now in nigeria you cannot use our naira cards online so it will be best if you can get this virtual card and you can use them to make payments for things that you want especially if you're an advertiser or someone who runs facebook and instagram ads okay so this is very simple like i said again if you want to add money to this account or you want to deposit you have to use a usdt account you have to deposit into a into your usdt address okay so if you don't know how you can do that or if you need somebody who can do that you can contact me privately and i can get you someone who you will send naira to and the person will send would fund your usdt account and you can easily use that or change that into dollar and use that to fund your card or issue your card and add money to your card and then you can use your card on every platform that you want to use it okay this platform is amazing and i want you to try it out and let me know exactly what you think about this platform okay try pst.net and let me know exactly how it works for you thank you so much for watching my video i'll see you in the next one